carvings upon the great stone wall at Shikra tell of a time beyond memory, a time of world-shattering war, when the brave and the desperate rose up against the three masters of evil. They were Morgoth, Lord of Beasts, who sent savage armies over the land. Necros, master of war, who incited all man to rage eternal. <laughs> and Olga, the overlord, who blackened the world with his foul magic. <laughs> and beasts, all inhabitants of the world were locked in hopeless fever battle against a black fate. Raging like a great fire, insanity swept across the land with the ferocity unmatched in all history. But when at last the smoke had cleared, the masters of evil had suffered a crushing defeat. Humiliated, they retreated to a place outside of time, and a black seal was crafted to prevent their return. Of all who fought, only three returned to tell the story. A dwarf, an elf, and a human. Though their names were lost in the mists of time, their labor stands yet today. For the black seal holds fast, protecting mankind from certain destruction at the hand of the Overlord. Hi everybody and welcome to my Retro Friday edition. Today we're going to be looking at Pop Fu Mail on the Sega CD. I dug this little gem out and I'm going to show it to the world. <laughs> so let's play. This is going to be a fun game. I never actually beat this game before. I just, I have it in my collection. I don't remember. So let's, we're going to start the game. Oh my god! <laughs> I think this game was rated like E for everybody! <laughs> She's a badass. <laughs> oh. Maybe not. I I take that back. <laughs> Nutscracker. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, uh, don't be down on yourself. There's a whole world of adventure out there. She's a girl who knows what she wants. Action. Move it, coming through, step aside. Hmm. With a capture of the notorious magician Muttonhead, a reward is offered in the sum of two million gold. Well, this seems like a really cool adventure. Let's see how it pans out for us. Well, this is cool. It reminds me of Yeez. Alright, let's see what we can do here. Welcome to Elf Woods. Alright. Huh. <laughs> These giant raccoons are as big as me. Elf Village. Be careful. Monster attack zone. Hmm. Hey! Hey you! Help! What was that? It, it sounded on like... Hey! Are you blind or something? Up in the tree, a dunderhead! What's a dunderhead? <laughs> You tell him, Popful. God, what an arrogant jerk. Just asking some strange girl in the middle of the forest or jungle to help him out. What is his what is his deal? I wanna go this way, what's over here? Huh. Ooh, money. I gotta have up oh, dead end. Gotta have that money. Alright, let's see what's up here. Since you can't go anymore. Huh. This game's really not that hard. Huh, huh. Oh no, it's this guy again. Oh well, let's talk to him. 
No, you gotta take no for an answer. Whoa. This is a little risque right here. <laughs> She's worth two million. Wow. What did I say again? Why are you back here again without help? Hurry and tell the villagers where I am. No! You're a jerk. Trying to pay me like I'm some common girl. I'm upscale. So I think we can say that Popful here is very high class. Ooh, what's it? Oh, an apple. There we go. Oh, well, we, at least I won't starve. What? Ow. <laughs> Landed right on our bum. Come on, hurry up. Ah! Oh, wow, what? Come on, die, spider. Spider hit me like three times. That wasn't fair. I'm getting mad. Danger ambush zone. Well, let's check it out. Elf village ahead. Enter the next hole. Ah! Hey, where did you come from? We don't get many visitors out here. Huh. Ouch. Another slick caper, eh? Right? What has he done this time? Justified smile. <laughs> well, let's see. Monsters chased him up a tree. Now the dumb kid's too scared to come down. And he's waiting for your help. Like a second story job. We'll take it from here. Second story job it is. Ha ha ha. Well, at least she did a good deed. Ooh, what's here? Hello there. What can I do for you today, my lady? Ooh. Well, I'd like some healing. Some sexual healing. All right. Took 68 gold, but that's okay. What do you got for sale? Food and an amulet. All this stuff is pretty expensive. What can I sell? Uh. Oh, thank you. Do you find that crybaby slick? Yeah, I did. He stuck him in a tree, lady. Dumb kid was trying to pay me for escort services. It's quite strange to have visitors in our little village. Another guy with a red cape was here a while ago, too. He said he was on a quest to find his mentor. The path he took is crawling with monsters. I hope he's okay. Yeah, I hope so, too. Well, let's go weapon shop. How can I be of assistance today? Uh, short sword, leather armor, wooden shield. Ooh, plain leather armor. 500 gold, and I just have 500 gold. I'll take it. Yeah. We'll beef up a little bit. Pop Fu Mail's a rough and tough girl. And she needs all the protection in the world. Where's that? Oh, there it is. There we go. Oh, I feel stronger already. Look at Anybody down here? Anybody down here? No? Alright. Looks like I'm done with this village. 
soldiers of the village have never fought against monsters. Because of that, we're a pretty poor swordsmen. We don't stand a chance. You guys need to train. Ugh, ugh. Get up there. Get hard. Come on. Ba -ba -da. The music's pretty catchy. Well, hi. What brings you here, stranger? A male. Powerful male. You see, I'm looking for a magician called Muttonhead. There's a bounty of two million gold on his head. Oh, well, you're on the right path, because I saw that rotten gingerbread grifter gang pass this way. They're in league with Muttonhead, you know. What? They were here and you let them get away? Where are they? Which way did they go? Calm down, Vale. I'm after those crooks, too. By the way, I'm Namo. If you happen to find them, let me know, and I'll help you nab them. Oh, sure. And let you get the reward. Nice try, Haystack. Well, I'll tell you, Bounty Hunter. I'm very strong. Just keep me in mind, okay? Everybody wants to be with Popful Mail. She's quite the popular girl. <laughs> Alright, let's see. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Talk about the money. What's over here? Nothing. All right, we'll go with the ladder. Oh, she's baddies. <laughs> I can't tell if there's a a platform over there. Or if I make a mistake. Oh, there is. Oh, 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 I got a leaf or something. What did I get? What did I get? What did I get? I don't know. It's not my inventory. But I got something. Oh! No, no, no. Go this way. Look at that expert dodging ability. Slid right under him. Ooh, another leaf. I don't know why I don't get him in my inventory. Elf Mountain. Watch for falling rocks. Well, at least these signs are great for, for uh, travelers. <laughs> Can't get it. What? Kill that guy. Oh, what's that? Oh my. It's some sort of robot rock. Robo rock. Huh. Yeah. Alright, I can't go up any higher. Let's go over here. Wee. I don't like. Primitive golems. And they're like golems that can't be used out of magic. They have to be used as like a wind-up toy. <laughs> That's pretty funny. This game's actually pretty fun. I actually like this game. I kind of want to play all of it. <laughs> oh, let's go up here. Something up here. We. This is the Sega CD version. I think I said so. It's gonna be. Ooh. Ooh. What is this? It's like a whole other room. Oh, it's an empty room. Well, that's. Oh, well, there's nothing to do here. That's weird. That raccoon lied to me. He was like, there's something good in here. Alright, let's see where we go. Let's go. Oh, wait, is this the jump? Oh, I don't know. I, I don't know. If that's the jump... I think I can get that treasure chest. I think. I think this is it. Oh, man. Alright. Oh, 
Oh my god! I tried to do the Assassin's Creed leap of faith, and I overshot it. Oh no! Ow! I gotta get up there. Oh, oh come on. Alright, we're gonna try and jump there again. Oh, yeah, I can't control my jumps in midair. Ugh. That's okay. <laughs> we'll do it again this time. Oh. I don't know what these rocks are trying to do. Rock monsters are trying to do to me. They're like, they're pour, they're they're pouring their hearts out at me. They're rocky hearts. <laughs> All right, let's do it again, Popful. She's just a fiery red-headed girl named Popful Mill. <laughs> oh, made it! All right, cool. What's in here? An orange. All that for a piece of fruit. It's gonna come in handy. That that we're gonna you know what this orange is gonna be so special because I had to jump off a mountain to get it. It's probably a secret item. We're gonna save our orange. Alright, we gotta climb up the mountain a third time. Boom. Tell you what, this background music really won't keeps me going. It's so cheery. Whoa! -ho -ho. Like, if I would have climbed up that ladder, that thing would have gave me a free tea bag. Well, we don't want that. Popful is an elegant, classy lady. She, oh, there's someone up here. I don't know who he is. I don't know this. Oh, I can't go that way. Who's this guy? Hello there. Say, I watched you slash your way up here. Most impressive, I must admit. Who are you? I'm Mail, Popful Mail. Right now I'm after a dangerous magician called Muttonhead. There's a big reward for him. Oh? Muttonhead used to be my teacher. He was once a kind and wonderful person. But then, all of a sudden, he turned evil. I'm looking for him to see if I can't find out what went wrong. Actually, I should say I was going after him, but the monster just ahead stopped me dead in my tracks. He's much too powerful for my simple scepter. Don't worry. I'm sure I can take him. I've had a lot of practice lately. This shouldn't take long. Okay. Well, be careful. Let me know when it's all clear, okay? I bet you Popple Mel was like the most popular girl in high school and she was also like really really like mean to people. She's like, I can do anything because I'm special. <laughs> She's got that attitude. She's like, oh, what's that? Oh, I can handle anything. <laughs> All right. Boss fight. Oh, the mad bomber has appeared. <laughs> Ouch. He's got a simple attack. I'm just gonna sit right here. And another freebie. Ooh! -ho! Slashed him before he got to the ground. That's a sweet finisher right there. Destroyed the mad bomber. Okay. the passage blockage crumble oh wait I should go back I should tell him I just killed that monster wow you destroyed the mad bomber now I can get on with the search for my master didn't I say he'd be a piece of cake I don't kid around when it comes to a fight well as I said your skills are quite impressive by the way, I'm Tat, a 
apprentice magician extraordinaire. Hopefully we'll meet again soon. Oh, he's a nice guy. <laughs> My skills are quite impressive. Ooh. Tree Sun. Visit again real soon. The elves. Oh, well, that's cool. What's over here? Well, this is probably where I'm going to stop it. I'll resume this either next Friday or if I get many more likes and stuff. Um, yeah, maybe I'll put it up sooner. Uh, this is my Retro Fridays where I play everything from Nintendo, Famicom, all the way up to like Sega CD and N64 games. I have a whole bunch. So, uh, yeah, hopefully if you like more, I'll post more. Uh, see you next Friday.